Thank you guys so much for tuning in. That is right, you guys. This is my top five power rankings of week 12. I'm so hyped I had to stand up for this one, you guys. All right, let's go. Number five this week, top five is the Cleveland Browns. That is right, you guys. They came up on a big one. They beat the Steelers. I picked the Steelers to win, and they did not get it done. That is right, okay? Last week, they signed. Joe Flacco, but Dorian Thompson Robinson, he got the job done. Okay, we will see how that plays out. Watson, he is out for the rest of the year. Cleveland Browns defense is epic. They deserve to be in my top five, and they are, you guys. Okay, they're one game back of first place in the AFC North. And let's get it, all right? Number four. Yeah, that's right. The other number one team in the AFC North, that's the Ravens, you guys. They're eight and three right now. They're balling out. They just beat my Bengals, Joe Bengal. I mean, Joe Burrow, obviously, he's out. He's out for the year. That was epic. But listen, the Ravens, Mark Andrews out as well. So we will see how this plays out for the rest of the year. Number four, my Ravens. All right, you guys. Um, Lamar Jackson, he's throwing. He's passing 70% or completing 70% of his passes. Throwing 2,441 2, yards, 12 TDs, and five interceptions on the year. Gus Edwards, Zay Flowers, Mark Andrews. Oh, we'll see about that one. Odell Nelson, Bateman. Let's go, you guys. All right, step up number four. This week, top five power ranking. I'm I'm excited, you guys. This is epic. Number three, number three, San Francisco 49ers, you guys. Okay, that is right. Seven and three. They're coming off a huge win last week against Tampa Bay. They bounced back. Brock Purdy, he was perfect. He was 21 of 24. He was epic. Uh, number one in the NFC West. Obviously, you guys, they're healthy. They got everybody running right now. Debo, Kittle, uh, Ayuk, McCaffrey. All right, Purdy, you guys, everybody's doing their thing. Uh, Brock Purdy, he's throwing 2,700 yards, 18 touchdowns, five interceptions. Number three this week, top five power ranking, you guys. All right, let's go. Number two, let's go. Philadelphia Eagles. That is right, you guys. Your Eagles, 9-1, the best in the NFL. Let's get it. All right, listen. Jalen Hurts, he keeps proving me wrong, okay? 150 yards, and they got the win, okay? They're on a four-game win streak. The Eagles are doing their thing. They're making the world a believer. I got to give them respect. They beat Miami, Washington, Dallas, and Kansas City. Let's go, okay, you guys? Swift, Smith, A.J. Brown, stand up. Number two. I know y'all ain't ready for this one. I know y'all ain't ready for this one. Hold up. Hold up. Number one this week, top five power rankings is, again, my Detroit Lions. That is right, you guys. I told you guys they will be number one for the rest of the year. They scared me, though. They scared me, okay? They're eight and two. They first place in the division. They battled back to win an epic thriller over the Bears. Golf, he, he played bad, you guys, okay? It's all right, because we got that man, Dan Campbell. All right, you guys, Texas A&M, stand up. All right, New York Giants, first pick, I mean, third round pick in the NFL. Dan Campbell, you're about it, tight end. He, he, if y'all don't know Dan Campbell, okay, you guys, coached at uh, the Saints, coached at the Dolphins, played for the Cowboys, played for the Lions. He's that man. He's that dog. Dan Campbell got the team ready, hyped. Let's go, you guys. Okay, you guys. Listen, coach of the year right now, you guys. Averaging 27.2 points a game. They're 8 and 2 for the first time since 1964. I am so hyped. Detroit Lion fans, stand up. Okay, you guys. This is your year. I am so hyped. Let's go. Right now.